Hey guys, it's Mr. Kingdom Cash Charles Dyson here. And in this video, I'm going to show you guys how to place a trade. All right. So this is your quote screen in your MetaTrader 4 app. Okay. Let's say you wanted to trade a pair that you do not see on this screen. Well, there's a plus sign in the top, top right hand corner. All we do, all you would do is click that plus sign, right? And it would look like this, right? So I want to search for the pair. So I'm going to swipe my finger down just a little bit and the search bar pops up. And then I would type in the pair I'm looking for. If I was looking for a Euro pair, I would type in EUR. If I was looking for a, U a US dollar pair, I would type in USD. But you just type in whatever pair you're looking for, right? And if you don't see, if you see it, it pop up, you will see GBP AUD or whatever pair you're looking for. Just click the plus sign, right? And then it would add it. Then you can cancel out and go back and then you would see it appear here at the bottom. Okay. But in this example, I'm already in a few trades, right? Um, on this small account that I have and, uh, what you would do let's say I wanted to place a GBP AUD pair. This is just how to place a trade, right? In further videos, in future videos, I'll show you guys how to take a partial profit, how to take profit, how to move stop loss and different interesting things like that, right? But in this example, I'm just going to place um, another GBP AUD trade, um, a buy position since I'm already winning in that trade. So what I would do is I would come over here and go to GBP AUD. Now I can just press trade from here, or I can go to the chart and press and trade press trade from there. But I'm gonna just press trade right now. Okay, I'm gonna just put in a small lot size, right? And here I would put in my stop loss, whatever I would want my stop loss to be. And here I will put in whatever I want my take profit to be. Now I can click market execution and I can change the type of trade, buy limit, sell limit, buy stop, sell stop. I'm not going to go over the different type of orders in this video, but that's where I would actually edit that, right? I want to do a market execution because I want to get in the trade right now. Right here where it says 0 0.01, this is going to be my lot size. So I can put in whatever lot size I want to use. And remember, 0 0.03 is not 3 cents. That's actually 30 cents. 0 0.01 is not one penny is actually 10 cents. 0 0.25 is not 25 cents. It's actually $2.50. Remember that. All right. This is extremely important. Be careful when you are actually putting your lot size in. Make sure you understand what you are entering. Okay. All right. So in this example, we're going to do just a 0 0.01, a 0 0.01 lot size. And I'm in a buy. So I'm going to just do a market execution buy. Now, notice I didn't put in any uh, stop loss or take profit, right? Now, if I want to edit that trade to enter my stop loss and take profit, let me see what I put in. I put in a 82, 252 for a stop loss. All I would do is swipe to the left and I have options here, right? If I want to edit my stop loss, you see the pencil? I can click the pencil and it gives me the opportunity to edit what I wanted to edit, my stop loss. So I can enter it in, click modify, and now my stop loss is there, right? I wanna put my take profit in, 82,953. Okay, so I'm gonna swipe left, click the pencil, and I'm gonna put in my take profit. And now I have my stop loss and my take profit in. As you can see, the trade has already gone in, well, it's bouncing around. But if I can get it into profit while I'm recording right now, I'll just show you guys how to take profit right now. But um, to keep this video short, I'll cut this one off and I'll show you how to take profit in another video, all right?